Mary Lucilia Dalcon, better known as Lucille, of Forrester Castries, passed away at her residence on Monday, January 31st, 2022, at the age of 69. She was a past vendor in the Castries market. Left to mourn her common-law husband, Carlton Joseph, better known as Fiello, a construction worker of Forestier. Daughters, Nadia Duncan of Forestier, employee of Sanders Regency Latoc, Samantha Dalcan of Forestier, housekeeper at Entropol. Sons, Kamala's Word John of Forestier, a construction worker. Thompson Dalcan of Forestier, employee of Beachcomber Limited. Ronald Dalcan and Robinson Dalcan, both of Forestier, minibus drivers on Route 5D Castries. Children's father, Arthur Dalcan, better known as Fawkes, a farmer of Forestier. Seventeen grandchildren, including eight grandsons, Carly Jonathan Dalcan of Forestier, mechanic at HNC Company Limited, Prince Benjamin Dalcan of Forestier, self-employed, Julian Chauvin Roberts of Forestier, employee of the Senusha Bureau of Standards, Simeon Dalcan of Forestier, employee of Vision Express, Rohan Dalcan of Bacatel Castries, Raim Dalcan of Forestier, student of the Cicero Secondary School. Denzel Dalcan of Forestier, student of the Babano Secondary School. Jeremiah John of Forestier, student of the Castries Comprehensive Secondary School. Navid Dalcan of Forestier, student of the Forestier Methodist Combined School. Nine granddaughters. Kishal Dalcan of Corinth. Lydia Sabrina Dalcan of Forestier, employee of MNC Company Limited. Suzanne Dalcan of Forestier, student of the South Lewis Community College. Lorianne Dalcan of Forestier, student of the St. Joseph's Convent Secondary School. Candia Lambert and Mariah John, both of Forestier and students of the Forestier Methodist Combined School. Katie John of Babano, employee of KM2 Solutions Limited. Katie John of Forestier, student of the Antropo Secondary School. Eight great grandchildren. Michaela Emil of Babano, student of the Gordon and Walcott Memorial Methodist Combined School. Marissa Dalcan of Forestier, student of the Tiroche Primary School. Malik Dalkan of Forestier, student of the Anglican Infant School. Keyshawn Dalkan of Bocage, student of the Tiroche Primary School. Yannick Jamont of Marsha, student of the St. Joseph's Convent Preschool. Jonathan Zane Dalkan and Haley Senfor, both of Forestier. Rosan Dalkan of Bacatel. One son in law. Alian Atale of Martinique, daughters-in-law Selma Dalcan of Forestier, Alicia Casey John of Forestier, employee of KM2 Solutions, Valicia Kodra of Forestier, employee of Senusha Linen Services, three sisters, Marilyn John and family, Rose Moise and family, and Mary Alexander, better known as Clarita and family, all of Forestier and vendors at the Castries Market. Two brothers, Philip John, better known as Sonny, and Nicholas John and family, both of Forestier and minibus operators on Route 5D Castries. The family of deceased brother Randolph John of Forestier. The family of deceased brother Hayden John of Forestier. The family of deceased sister Elizabeth John of Forestier. Three uncles, Luther Jagannath of Auger, Dennis Juahir of Forestier, 
Donna Joie here of La Pansy. Three ons. Magna Ishmael of Forrester. Rachel and Ivy Jagannath of Auger. Nine nieces and fifteen nephews residing here and abroad. In Martinique, Barbados, the U.S., London and Canada. Also left to mourn are the Jagannath family of Auger, the Kodra family of Forestier and Auger, the Shangu family of Bexar, the Karu family of Chasse and Forestier, the Biru family, the John family, the Joahiro family, the Dalkan family and Ishmael family, all of Forestier, the Edward family of Mondo. Caretakers, Angelina Patience and Kathy McLaurin, both of Old Victoria Road, Castries. Other families and friends, too numerous to mention. The funeral service for the late Mary Lucilia Dalcon, better known as Lucille, will be held at the Sacred Heart Church at Marsha on Wednesday, February 16, 2022 at 2.30pm. The body will be laid to rest at the Shock Cemetery. Persons attending the funeral service are asked to wear a touch of pink and are encouraged to observe all COVID-19 protocols. Transportation service will be provided by the Evergreen Coaster, which will be stationed near the Forrester Methodist Church and departs at 2 p.m. The family would like to inform everyone that due to COVID-19 protocols, they would like to mourn in private after the funeral service. Her body now lies at Rambadis Funeral Parlor, Calvary Road, Castries.